Hello guys, welcome back to F5 Developers. I hope you are enjoying the tutorials and today we are going for pattern design with the help of some geometric shapes. For example, your triangle, rectangle, square, pentagon, hexagon with the help of these shapes we are going for a pattern design. So let us start the session. yes guys welcome back to tutorials so today we are going for a pattern design how to draw a pattern in the scratch to do so we need some mathematical terms here we need to know about something so let me discuss that first guys you have to know about the horizontal line and the vertical line what is this this is called horizontal line and this is vertical line the horizontal line is called the x-axis and the vertical line is called the y-axis and these are when it cross each other these are called coordinates first one second third and fourth and these coordinates are of something like difference of 90 degrees so this is called as a 90 degrees difference why we are going for this angles cause we have to know about this square what is the square edge and angle how many edges in the square see there is four edges in the square and the what is the angle between them the angle is 90 degree like that you have to know about the pentagon what is the angle of a pentagon and what is the edges how many edges are there pentagon having five edges and the angle between them is 75 how to know this likewise the triangle see a triangle is having three edges one two three and how many what is the angle is in interior angle is 60 but the exterior angle is 120 likewise this is called hexagon what is the angle of this hexagon the angle of this hexagon is this is 60 degree difference all is having 60 degrees and how many edges there is six edges how to find this angle the main question is how to find the angle see uh, what is the angle you can say it here a straight line is having how much angle this is called 360 degree 360 degree so in 360 degrees you have to know how many edges in the square four edges so 360 divided by 4 can you tell me the answer yes it's 90 degree right it's 90 likewise you can go for the triangle it's come almost about 120 likewise this one 360 divided by 6 it's 60 and pentagon 360 divided by 5 it's called 75 sorry 72 the answer is 72 so you have to know this much to go for the pattern design let me go for a pattern one come to the scratch now and let me uh, introduce with some new features in this scratch that is this one add extensions when you click in the add extensions you have the option to add some multiple features in this scratch you can see this uh, multiple features are there so you can use these features right now i need to use this pen so i'm going for pen see when i click that the window the new box will come of a pane which have some boxes like this 
so how to use this boxes and what why we are going to use this this is the main question so let me introduce with my character that is our sprite one by default actually it is cat so i'm just going for decrease its size and now how to draw a pattern you have to draw a pattern with the help of program so how to start the program go to the events take first one is when the flag clicked and the second one is you have to go for some steps before that you have to understand this one what is the meaning of this two boxes pane down and pane up this pane down means you want to write something and pane up means you want you don't want to write now okay and what is the meaning of erase all this erase all means you want to delete the entire window which is written in the your this window so i am going to use this one first erase all whenever i click the flag button it has to be erase first then when after that the pane down means you have to start your work i am ready to start my work likewise you have to go for some practice what the kind of practice to repeat something to write something or to draw something right so how to draw for example if i want to move 60 steps or 70 steps you can see this if i want to move let me go for 70 steps i'm clicking can you see this the line yeah see this line this is of 70 steps likewise if after moving 70 steps if i turn left see clockwise and anti clockwise right means you have to go for clockwise and anti clockwise means you have to go for right si uh, left side so i'm just going for right side how many degrees if i want to move 90 degrees let me go for 90 degrees can you see this yeah it is ready to move 90 degrees see yes but i want to repeat it again and again see our difference is it is not completed the square this is the part of square so how to complete it go for the controls there is a option of repeat use this block how many edges in the square there is four edges so i am going for repeat it four times now you can observe see if you are not able to see this let me go for delay okay it is easy for you guys so now you can see yes so it is going to develop a square now the question is um i want to develop some pentagon or hexagon how to do that so you are going to give me the answer how many edges in the hexagon there is hexagon means six edges uh this is depend on you guys what is the length you want to do and the angle what is the angle so you have to do 360 divided by 6 is almost can you tell me yes it's 60 now go for it yes likewise i can go for pentagon five edges and the difference is one it's 72 right now yes and likewise you can go for the triangle three and difference is 120 yes likewise so it is the pattern design 
it is not a pattern actually it is a some shapes the triangle square hexagon pentagon these are the shapes how to draw a pattern with the help of these shapes yes so we have to use same thing the repeat once again i'm going for repeat it again how many times it depends on you let me go for 30 times i'm repeating this triangle this triangle 30 times but the problem is can you see this f let me remove the delay it is can you see this yes it is repeating 30 times with the same uh, properties the uh, repeat 3 times 70 degree, 70 angle and 120 degrees but in the same place in the same place so it is not showing as a pattern you have to use some decline means some angle deviate it from some small angle let me go for 8 degree now you can observe it can you yes if i am going for delay it will go slow okay if you want let me go for delay but it takes some time let me go for delay here and it's a small delay 0 0.2 seconds only now you can observe the same thing See, I am going for 30 steps and 30 repetition of triangles. So that's why the circle is half. If I am going for 50, you can observe here. See, circle will be completed. Likewise, you can go for some different angles, I um, mean, some different shapes and size. If I want to take now you can observe this is a good one see this is a pattern yes or no yes so if you are on to do for let me go for some pentagon shapes pentagon how many angles it's 72 right now you can observe it look so good right it looks so good now some extra features are there in the paint option you have the option of change paint color set paint color okay so you can use this colors for the difference let me use this one okay let me go for okay 10 let it be 10 see It will give you different colors all the times so it looks nice likewise you can go for different shapes and size so what we have learned today we have learned about the angles the triangle property how to find the angle of a triangle of a pentagon hexagon uh, this square and how to draw a pattern with the help of the program as well as as well as how to draw a shapes with the help of program see this is the okay let me do this this is for the shapes right this is for the shapes and when i am repeating it again with some angle delay angle delay okay then it will looks like a pattern so it's okay i think you have done this okay then thank you thank you for being here